All right. Hey, Gene. Steve, so delighted to be here. We are here to uh, share a video that Gene and I did together for, it's really, I think it's the world's first pair programming chop video, chat or anything. <laughs> and so Gene's going to tell you a little bit about it and then we'll jump into the video. Steve, you and I met about two months ago and we had this amazing conversation about the death of the junior developer. And that was such a mind blowing experience. You gave this amazing talk at the Enterprise Technology Leadership Summit. And my friend, John Willis said, watching your talk felt like being at the Velocity Conference in 2009, when John Allspaugh and Paul Hammond gave the talk about how they were doing 10 deploys a day, every day, Flickr. People were throwing up in the aisles that people were passing out because it seemed so irresponsible and preposterous and maybe even immoral notion that you shouldn't be coding by hand anymore. You should all, it should be through chat or programming. And we just set the context for this. We're talking about, was there a programming task that I wanted to do that would be normally out of reach? And uh, since January, yeah, I've been working on this. I have all these green shots on my phone. So whenever I'm watching a YouTube video or uh, listen to a podcast, and when I hear something interesting, I take a screenshot. And so I have thousands of these, like 5,000 of them over the last decade. But how many times have I actually gone back and watched it? It's, it's like only a handful. And I wrote this thing where I throw them into an LLM. And I ask for the podcast name, the episode name, and extract the current play time. And we we're talking, I'm like, gosh, wouldn't it be great if we could write something where we would throw it at FFmpeg and it would extract out the desired time. And the goal was, can we do it in two hours? <laughs> and we went for it. Steve, how am I doing in terms of characterizing what the goal was? So to summarize, it is, we're going to take the program that you've already written that can show the transcripts from the videos that you've taken screenshots of. Mm -hmm. And we're going to extend that program to generate an FFmpeg call that extracts out an excerpt from each video and yep. uh, puts uh, captions in. Oh, that's right. Yep. yep. Yeah. All right. With that in mind, let's get to it. 